it's Amanda. Welcome to my channel. Today we're doing a little bit of a haul. Um, I bought, got some stuff on Amazon and at Hobby Lobby to um, set up my new uh, planner, which is the Avec Hobonichi Techo Cousin, which is the July through uh, December. So it's a half year planner. And I decided that I'm probably gonna I'm gonna use this for memory keeping and journaling from using my um instead of using the Sienna type vertical that I've been using. Um I find that like I wanna do more stuff in it. Um so having the the whole page dailies would be useful. So I'm gonna get I first got let's flip this around for it. Got these um they're supposed to be transparent circle dots um, that I want to use to set up my planner, like my pre-plan and my monthly. So they're like just like kind of trans transparent, not completely, but yeah. I think that one's supposed to be stuck to this one, or there's just two of them. Interesting. There's two of them. Maybe. I think that came off. I think that's supposed to be one, one stack. <laughs> and then we have these colors. So I thought these would be perfect for setting up things. Um, I'm probably going to take some to work as well. I wonder why I did that. Interesting. Let's stick this one on here. That was weird. So there we have it. Kind of see through. I like them. They're fantastic. I have a uh, plain clear ones, like clear, like literally clear ones, like this that I use. Um, but I needed something that had some color to it so I can actually see where it is. But I still wanted it to be transparent. So there's that. You can see like the slightly different color. Right. Next up, I got some, uh, these are just like black sticky notes. Um, I wanted to use these to use these to, um, do like redaction so I can do like completed flip throughs. So I got some of these just black paper sticky notes that get my white pen. We can use so I like I like this. These are we're gonna, we're gonna test that out. Put that over here for my sticker graveyard. Put those back in there. Then I got let's put that back over here. We'll save that for last. The best for last. Put that piece put that stuff over there. So I got um this is just some vellum with silver stars on it. So I got two sheets of that. Uh, I got this vellum with the um, flower pattern and I got this um, like floral, distressed floral to kind of use it. And I was thinking of using it as a like cover, like a decorative cover for the Hobonichi. Um, I haven't decided because I got this, I saw the star ones and I have these two um, paper packs that are like celestial and I really like it. I kind of want to use some of these. There's one of them like, like this one I really want to use. So we'll see how planner like in this one with the silver star on it I think would be pretty but we'll see how it is when I do my setup I don't know if I'm going to do it on camera or if I'm going to um just do like a flip through of the setup because this is my first time doing this I mean I've seen a few like what is it whoops I did it again um there's a lot of like different like um stology and um like Hobonichi setups out there so Specifically, Stology, but this is I popped it open already because it was 
wanted to look at it. So it comes with this little like thing that I'm sure if I read, if I could read Japanese, it would be helpful. Um, <laughs> unfortunately, I do not. This one is in Japanese. This is a, oh, this is cool. I guess maybe, is this supposed to be a paper tester? <laughs> is it day free? Is this like what the day free would look like? Sort of look like that. I don't know. I don't know. I don't read Japanese, so maybe I'll use the Google Translate on it later and see what it says. So this is the A5 Hobonichi Techo Cousin. Um, it's the Avec, uh, which is the half year. So the Avecs come, like, the Cousin comes, like, at a whole year, but this is, and then it has the Avec version, which is half a year. So it's January through June, and then July through December. And so we, I thought, eh, let's try it out. So it has a pretty good, I've, I've used the full year Hobonichi in 2019. Um, but this paper, like, from what I heard, like, the, they're changing the, the way they do the Tomoe River paper. Um, so this paper actually does feel a little bit different, I think. I'll have to, like, dig my other one out of storage. So as you can see, it's all in Japanese. I have some stickers somewhere. I have printed out some stickers from Stickers and Doodles to cover up the Japanese stuff so that I can have it in English. So that's going to be part of my setup. But yeah, so it has like the couple years at a glance. So this is 2023. Tw why? I don't understand why you put the year previous in here. I don't know. We'll cover it up with something I'm sure. 2014 could be useful. And then we have the monthly, like, what, 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 what would you call these? The, it's the year in four pages, according to the, the thing. But yeah, so I have the sticker covers to go with. I need to find um, sticker dots to go, like stickers to go over this. So that it's like Sunday, Monday, Tuesday. I haven't really figured out what it, to use this for, but it's really cool. This is cool that it has sun through July through sorry July through December. But it also has January through June um, in this of 2024, which is nice. And then it starts off with the months. So June this starts a year a month early in June. Then we have July, August. September, yeah, this paper feels different. Nine, it could just be that it feels different than my happy planner. So 10th, October 19th, December, and then it goes January, February, and then it goes just January. Yeah, January, just January, which is nice. And then the weeklies start with Pride Week. So next week, um, not this coming week, but the next week. Um, in here, that's pretty cool. And so it just goes through the weeks and it goes until, so this is the December. Ah, that's cool. Like, oh, that's cool. Let me look. Is the, two, is 20, 2024 going to start on a Monday? Because if so, oh, that's awesome. That's awesome. I love it. I love it. Okay. So there we have that. And then we have the like sort of divider page that goes into the months. Then we have the monthly divider page, which they're all like different colored. Um, I think it's interesting that they color the weekends, but they don't color the thing. We'll figure it out. I like that blue. That's my favorite blue right there. So, yay. So 
So those are the dailies. So going into the next month, this one doesn't have that page in there, but it goes into the next page. And then so this one's just falling out that way, it looks like. I remember in my other Hobonichi, like, oh, here we, like, it would go, I think it had like an extra page. Like if it was like this, they would have a page and dot grid in another one, or is that a different one? I think I might be confused. At least I thought it should have that. <laughs> and then we have the dashboard, and then we have, oh, even the grid, are, are even the grids that color? Oh, I didn't even notice that. I wish the gray, I, th I wish it was just gray. Like, or like this blue. But whatever, we'll deal with it. And then of course we have some regular, like if it was just like this kind of grid, it'd be perfect. Um, random pages that I don't think anybody uses other than to put like another sticker on top of it and use it for some sort of collection. Um, like I said, I don't know what any of this says cause I don't read Japanese. Though, it might be useful if I could. Oh, this is a cute one. What is this? Oh, is this like the year of the, like the, the Zodiac? Or something? I don't know. I'll have to look it up. But yeah, and then it has like the little code that you can use, like register your thing if you lose it or whatever. But yeah, that is the flip through of the Hobonichi Atecho Cousin of Vac. I can't wait to set it up. I hope you enjoyed my little haul here. If you did, give it a like, comment down below, subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Bye.